Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It's Real Madrid against Atletico Madrid. The instructions will have been clear from the managers, Derek. Stick to the game plan. Don't take risks in your defending third and embrace the occasion. Don't be frightened of it. What a game this should be. Well, you know, I think we should always have respect for true midfield maestros and Luka Modric falls in that category. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out the situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Toni Kroos plays with Luka Modric in central midfield. And the lead striker today is Karim Benzema. And this is the starting lineup for Atletico. Jan Oblak stands between the posts. Stefan Savic plays with Jose Maria Jimenez in the center of defense. Rodrigo de Paul starts alongside Koke in central midfield. And up front, Morata starts alongside Antoine Griezmann. A really exciting game in prospect as Real Madrid get it underway. Modric. Here's Carvajal. Aurelia Chouameni. The ball with Luka Modric. Benzema. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Carrasco. Griezmann. Comfortable on the ball. Moving it forward here, Atletico. Griezmann. Here's Carrasco. He can't hold on to it. And I think the threat has been averted. And Alaba could be in trouble. Modric. Asensio. And a useful cross. Well, it still could be dangerous. And you've got to say, not the best of volleys that time. Yeah, it was certainly there to hit, but he just couldn't make the right contact. It was well wide in the end. Morata. Carrasco. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not really the ideal clearance. OK. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Vinicius Junior. And what can they do to stop him running at them? And a goal! As Real Madrid strike first in the final. And just listen to the fans. Well, we won't get tired of seeing this, will we? Because that struck so sweetly. He really does surprise everybody here, not least the keeper. What a good finish that is. moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be advantage Atletico Jimenez 
Koke. A very timely interception. Benzema. And a chance to whip it in here. Asensio. What a pass that lacks quality. Karim Benzema. Marcos Llorente. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, it looked like it might lead to something very positive indeed, but a useful interception. Vinicius Junior. Now with Benzema. Oh, it's cheeky. And the flag does go up. Must have been tight. Rudiger. Rudiger has it. Fluency of movement. Aurelien Chouameni. And there to intervene. Jimenez. On the ball, Morata. In the right place to cut out the pass. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Vinicius Jr. Real chance! And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, as the replay shows us, Vinicius Jr.'s pass is inch perfect. And then the perfect finish from Asensio. He really does hit this with power. That's an excellent goal. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So the ball rolling again. Atletico, after a less than stellar first half performance, looking to do better in the second half. Morata. Good visualization and execution. Alaba puts his body on the line. Blocks again. Mendy. This is Kroos. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Real Madrid get the throw in. Well, what a brilliant save that was. How did he keep that out? Well, not out of the woods just yet. This still could be dangerous. Well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Top class defending. Rodrigo de Paul.
Well, as you can see, Real Madrid have controlled the possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have... Cross! Well, a poor effort when all was said and done and simple for the keeper. Well, he's made a real mess of that, hasn't he? What a chance that was. Modric. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. This might be ideal for the counter. Llorente. Opportunity for them to get back into the game. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Into the final 20 minutes. Priority was to hang on to the ball, which he did. Determined defending. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the... Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Marco Asensio. Vinicius Jr. And a significant block following that cross. <laughs> Who can he pick out? Well, he was being closely watched. Goal kick. Well, the defender knew he couldn't get to the ball first, but he just did enough to put him off there. Well, they couldn't keep it. Rodrigo. And so into the final five minutes. Atletico have given it away. And teammates around him. Vinicius Junior. Wasted possession again. Morata. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. And here's a change now for Atletico. From Dombia with it. And the snuffing out of the cross there. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity.